This is a bit frustrating, all this rain, isn't it? Yeah, I know. I mean, I guess it was on the forecast and stuff, which is frustrating, but it's just one of those things. Obviously, you don't want it on your debut, nor for an amateur, but it's just one of those things. Still time, though, for you to get your maiden first-class wicket. <laughs> yeah, no, obviously, it was a great feeling. Um, good wicket to get as well, which is nice in the circumstances of the game. Um, and, yeah, it was really nice to get, to get that wicket. When you're waiting for your first wicket, sometimes it's a bit of an anticlimax, but that ball you bowled Jamie Smith was a beauty. No, yeah, it was nice. Just had a bit of a, a bit of late shape, which was nice. Got him driving, which is, which is what I wanted to do. Um, and, you know, just one of those days where you end up getting the nick, which is really nice. This game's moved quite rapidly forward in the short amount of time we've had in two days. Yeah, well, I mean, Dutchy bowled beautifully in that to get, you know, four wickets in that, and five overall in the session and four for him personally. You know, it was, it was great bowling. Um, and it's, you know, just a shame really that we've had, you know, a lot of this game so far taken out with weather. But, um, yeah, you know, a lot of wickets are falling and I think, you know, it's a good deck offering a bit to the batter and the bowlers. How would you sum up the wicket? Because we've seen a lot of boundaries. We've also seen a lot of wicket-taking balls, haven't we? Yeah, I think there's obviously nip in the wicket. There's a bit of shape. Um, but I think you get value for your runs. I think from the chat is it's slightly too paced. Um, but, you know, it's a quick quick outfield, even though it's wet, you know. You do get value for, for your shots. Um, but there's definitely enough in those right areas. How did you feel you bowled? Yeah, I thought I bowled nicely, you know. You know, obviously, first game, first spell, you know, it's a bit of nerves in that first, you know, first over, but, like, enjoyable. Do you know what I mean? You, you, I think you want to have those nerves, you know, it shows that, you know, you care about it and stuff. Um, and I thought I bowled nicely. Um, you know, hit good areas, quite nice to start with a maiden. And uh, nice to get, obviously, the wicket today. Now, those of us that only watch first-team cricket, we haven't seen you for a couple of seasons, not yeah. since that uh, T20 game against yeah. Gloucestershire. So it's been a while. Yeah, it has, yeah. You know, we've got, you know, it's strength of Hampshire, we've got such a you know, good squad, a lot of like depth in that squad. Um, had a couple of injuries, but, you know, normally just been playing quite a lot in the second team, um, doing well on that and just happy to, uh, to get a chance to play here. Would you say you put on a little bit of pace since we saw you two years ago? Yeah, I reckon so. I think in white ball cricket it's different. You, you know, you're trying maybe different balls, you know, colours, whatever. Um, but I reckon definitely in that two years of uh, bottom some yards, I reckon. And, and what's the aim now? Because with a shortened season, we're seeing a lot of youngsters play, not just at Hampshire, mm. but all around the country. You're one of a few. Do you see this as a big opportunity for you here? Yeah, I think it's, you know, any first first team cricket anywhere is, you know, a big opportunity. You, know, you want to you play well in front of the coaches, you know, and, and for yourself to know that, you know, you can play at this level. Um, so I think any opportunities by first team for anyone is, you know, an opportunity that's important. Really. There's a few injuries at Hampshire, so you might get a run here. Oh well, no, you don't. You don't want that to happen to anyone, really, do you? Like it's obviously a shame for anyone to to be injured and stuff, but you just gotta you gotta grab your chance. Um, but like I said, it's obviously a shame about circumstances injuries. And this is a ground that you've got used to, I guess, with all the practicing that you've done in the lead up to the start of the season. Yeah. So obviously we were here for however many weeks beforehand. Um, and played here a couple of times actually. Played in the 17s final a long time ago, and then some uh, two 2020 tournaments here in the finals. Um, so played it quite a bit. Um, certainly a bit of a trek, but it's it's a lovely ground. It is. Unfortunately, the the rain isn't doing it justice.